Welcome back to Lovely Lovebird Designs. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make this super cute star charm on the rainbow loom. These two are have little smiley faces on them, and I think they are just adorable, and they're really easy to make. And you can make a couple of them and hang them on a mobile, or just hang them on the wall. They're just really, I love them. And I made this one with electric glow purple, so it will glow in the dark too. You can make a little collage of stars and moons in the nighttime. And this one is without a smiley face. So in this tutorial, I'm going to use jelly yellow, and I'm going to make a smiley face. If you don't want a smiley face, you don't have to add it. And then you can just have a regular um, star charm. So once again, super easy, fun to make, and you can make a couple in a, in a variety of colors. Okay, let's get started. If you wanted to make a moon to go along with your happy star, I have this happy face tutorial too. I'm going to have the link on the description box of this tutorial. And that would be a really awesome moon too. So you can just change the colors around of the happy face, and it'll be a moon. So let's start looming. And I'm going to do the jelly yellow first. Okay, you need a single yellow or whatever color you'd like. That's a single. Then you need a double, so two. And then you need a triple. Okay, so three rubber bands, and we're just going to place it right here in the middle. And once again, it's a single loom, staggered position, arrow facing down. So this is one, two, and three rubber bands. Then we're going to make two rubber bands. Just need a double. And this is the middle of the star. And then another double. Okay. So then we're going to work on the side of the star. And we need a double. And here is that triple rubber band. And this is the double right here. So on this pin, so it's the fourth down one, two, three, and four. We're going to take our double and go to the side. Then we'll do another double and go from this pin to this pin. And then another double connecting. Okay, and then we'll repeat on the left side. And these are doubles. Okay, so we need a little cap and pin. It's going to be a single wrapped on this pin four times. So single, wrap four times. Two and three and four. Okay, so now we're gonna make the the points of the star. And you can do this on the hook or on the loom. And you will make you will need a triple. I'm gonna make it on the the uh, loom first and then I'll show you on the hook. So this is a triple, then you need a double, and then you need a single wrapped on this pin four times. One, two, three, and four. So I'm going to keep that right there, and if you want to continue making more of this, it's a triple, double, and the capping band four times. And you need four of these. So this is how you make it on the hook. It's very easy. You take a single, wrap it around four times. Then you take your double and bring the single right on there. Bring it back on. Make sure it goes in the middle. And then you take your triple. and then place that on the hook. And that is one of these guys. I'm gonna place this one right here. So I have one here, 
Here's number two. I'm going to make two more. So I'll put that on the loom. So I'm going to do a triple. So if you want to make it on the hook, you can make it on the hook. And on the loom, if you want to make it on the loom. So that's a triple. This is a double. And wrap, single wrap four times. Okay, so I have three. I need one more. So here's a triple. Here's a double. In a single wrapped four times. So if you do it on the hook, same thing. It's all the same. And we're just going to loom forward. So I'm going to go underneath this little cap and band. And loom forward. Same here. And here. Okay, and then you can take it off the hook, come off the board, make sure it's straight. I'm going to place one right here. Make sure it's straight and place one right here. And then one more right here. Okay, and then we're going to make the little smiley face and the eyes now. And if you don't want a smiley face, then you can just skip to the part where I'm starting looming. I need, um, I'm going to use black. You can use any color you want. I'm going to make the eyes. It's going to be a single, wrapped four times on the hook. Then another single, four times. Then you're going to take your the color of your star and bring the eyes on that band. So a single band. And we're just going to place it on these two pins right across. I'm going to separate the eyes. So it's going to stay right there. Okay, and we'll keep that single band right there. And we're going to loom this band first. So we're going to go underneath, grab the top two bands and bring it to the left side. Then we're going to loom this right side. Okay, now we're going to stop and we're going to take this band and this is going to be the mouth. I'm going to wrap it two times on the hook. So it just looks like this. Now we're going to grab this band and we're going to slide that little mouth on that band, as so, and bring it back on that pin. So it looks like that. Then we're going to grab this band and go forward, right in between the eyes. And now we're going to grab this band right here on the right, the lowermost band. Go forward, and now the diagonal. Okay, we're done with the right side, now the left. Okay, now this diagonal. And now this triple band. It's the three bands at the bottom. the 
is double, and now be single. We're just going to take this single right off, and we're going to make a slip knot. So I have the two bands right here. I'm going to pull this over, I'm going to make a knot, and pull taut. So now it's secured. Now you can slowly take it off the loom. Don't need the loom anymore. And we stretch him out all the points of the star. You see his two little eyes on the top and then his mouth. And you can keep it open like this so it's kind of like he's smiling. Or if you want to bring it down, you can pull it out and make it like long too, like that. But what I like to do, you can go behind, grab the mouth, and just pull it like more toward the middle of the star. It's a little tinier. And just bring it down like that. It's got a cute little mouth. You can bring out the eyes. And you can hang your star like this. You can also bring the like you know, the little bottom points down. You can hang your star like this and if you don't want to do that and just make it a charm, put your hook right through the top, bring your that excess band right through that section just one time then go through again, bring it back over and then you have a little point. Okay, and that's your little star. I think he came out really cute. You can smush him up. Make sure he, you know he, he's the way you want him. And if you don't want a smiley face, he'll look like that. This is made with regular yellow bands, and this is the jelly. So make glow in the dark. Anything you'd like. So that's my star tutorial. Please subscribe, lovely lovebird designs, and we'll see you soon. Bye bye. Three and four. So I'm going to keep that right there. And if you want to continue making more of this, it's a triple, double, and the capping band four times. And you need four of these. So this is how you make it on the hook. It's very easy. You take a single, wrap it around four times. Then you take your double. And bring the single right on there. Bring it back on. Make sure it goes in the middle. And then you take your triple. And then place that on the hook. And that is one of these guys. I'm going to place this one right here. So I have one here. Here's number two. Along with your happy star, I have a happy face tutorial too. I'm going to have the link on the description box of this tutorial. And that would be a really awesome moon too. So you can just change the colors around of the happy face and it'll be a moon. So let's start looming. And I'm going to do the jelly yellow first. Okay, you need a single yellow or whatever color you'd like. That's a single. Then you need a double, so two. And then you need a triple. Okay, so three rubber bands, and we're just gonna place it right here in the middle. And once again, it's a single loom, staggered position, arrow facing down. So this is one, two, and three rubber bands. Then we're going to make two rubber bands. Okay, so you need a little capping pin. It's going to be a single wrapped on this pin four times. So a single wrapped four times. Two and three and four. Okay, 
so now we're going to make the, the points of the star. And you can do this on the hook or on the loom. And you will make you will need a triple. I'm going to make it on the the uh, loom first, and then I'll show you on the hook. So this is a triple. Then you need a double, and then you need a single wrapped on this pin four times. One, two. Hello, welcome back to Lovely Lovebird Designs. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make this super cute star charm on the rainbow loom. These two are have little smiley faces on them, and I think they are just adorable, and they're really easy to make. And you can make a couple of them and hang them on a mobile, or just hang them on the wall. They're just really, I love them. And I made this one with electric glow purple, so it will glow in the dark too. You can make a little collage of stars and moons in the nighttime. And this one is without a smiley face. So in this tutorial, I'm going to use jelly yellow, and I'm going to make a smiley face. If you don't want a smiley face, you don't have to add it. And then you can just have a regular um, star charm. So once again, super easy, fun to make, and you can make a couple in, in a variety of colors. Okay, let's get started. If you wanted to make a moon to go along, you just need a double. And this is the middle of the star. And then another double. Okay, so then we're going to work on the side of the star. And we need a double. And here's that triple rubber band. And this is the double right here. So on this pin, so it's the fourth down, one, two, three, and four. We're going to take our double and go to the side. Then we'll do another double and go from this pin to this pin. And then another double connecting. Okay, and then we'll repeat on the left side. And these are doubles. 